Hi friends, this is Pastor Harley with the Broadway Church, and uh, I want to read to you from Luke chapter 14, verse 5. Again, we've been in the Gospels as we read through the, through the Bible for this year, and in the Gospel of Luke in chapter 14, the fifth verse, Jesus asks this question, and he said to them, which of you having a son or an ox that has fallen into a well on a Sabbath day will not immediately pull him out? Well, now that seems almost random to us. Um, it's been a long time since we watched Lassie and Timmy was forever falling into the old well or the mine and uh, people had to go and rescue him. Uh, almost none of us have had an ox uh, of any sort that ever got into any difficulty or an ox that stayed, you know, out of trouble. Uh, but Jesus is bringing up this, you know, he was getting in trouble because he healed on the Sabbath. It's almost like he intentionally healed on the Sabbath, but mostly when he met a need, he extended his healing touch. And they're looking at him as a healer that's, that's going around and he's getting a little money for this and he's earning his living. Is No, this is compassion for need. I'm showing compassion and bringing God's power to somebody's life. Yeah, even though it's the Sabbath. Listen, on the Sabbath, God gives life. On the Sabbath, God brings judgment. God, on the Sabbath, God deals with our souls. You can do everything the Father does on the Sabbath day. And also, J Jesus is saying, you see your brother in need. Take some responsibility. He says, if it was your child or your ox that had fallen into a well, big trouble there. Well, look at the need around you and take ownership and say, I also have a role in ministering to my neighbor's need, to relieving suffering, to taking people who are, who are downhearted and encouraging, encourage them, to pay, take people who are blind and lead them to the light of Christ. May you be all these things in the life of your neighbors and your family today. Amen.